I'm Jenny. I'm going to show you how to make a viewfinder inspired by the artist Yayoi Kusama and her relationship with nature. As a child, Kusama loved flowers and she would spend time drawing them in the meadows and in the greenhouses of her family's seed nursery in the mountains of central Japan. When she was around the age of 10, she started to notice dots in nature, from the roundness of the sun to flowers dotted across the field. She was especially fond of sunflowers, as we can see here. Seeing dots everywhere linked everything together and made her feel part of the wider universe. In her artwork, Infinity Mirror Rooms, she uses dots and mirrors to create new environments that express this feeling of endless time and space. Now, I'm gonna show you how to make your own Kusama-inspired viewfinder. You will need recycled cardboard tubes, flat cardboard, colored felt tip pens, scissors, tape and a hole punch. So first of all, what you're going to need is your cardboard tubing. And we're going to draw a line as a sort of guide all the way around, like that. Get your scissors and we're going to start cutting our petals. You could make your petals any shape. You might want to keep them about the same width. Put your finger on the inside and right at the bottom you're going to fold it out so it's flat. So we're opening up our flower. Take the flat piece of cardboard that we can find in the recycling. So it could be anything from like tea box to cereal box. And we're going to draw around the bottom. Then we're going to cut. You probably want this bigger rather than smaller. So try and stay on the outside of the line. I'm going to select a colour and we're going to colour in the centre. I think I might go with red. You can use coloured pencils for this or belt tips. So you can just colour this in lots of different colours or you can create different patterns. I think being as wild as possible is ideal. Lots and lots of dots. It can be all different shapes. All right, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna put that to the side for a second and we're gonna take the center of our flower. To get to the middle, we're going to fold it in half and then put it through. Ideally, you don't wanna double up the, the holes, but don't worry if they overlap. Then we're gonna open that up. It's lots of dots to look through. Now what we're gonna do is stick that in the middle. Cut just about over an inch of sellotape place that on the inside with the sticky bit facing outwards. Then we're going to have another piece and we're going to stick that on the opposite side with their stickiness facing outwards. Then you're going to push your two pieces of sellotape together, kind of have a sticky bridge and then you're going to place your dotty viewfinder centre on the top like that. And that's your finished viewfinder. Have a look through it. What can you see? There's lots of other things you can do with your viewfinder. You can stick two viewfinders together to create dotty sunglasses. Or create a dotty light show by using a light to cast shapes on the wall. Or you can turn it upside down. Fill it up with soil, plant a seed and watch it grow. And that's it. I hope you've enjoyed making. If you like, you can send what you've made to Take Kids, and we'd love to see your creations. <laughs>